Good morning. This is Swift Passage. Thanks for all you viewers locally and around the globe. I give God all the praise and glory on this channel. This is God's holy channel. This is God's holy channel. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not uh, unto your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge him. He will direct your path. Faith, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Amen. Philippians 4 verse 13. Thank you guys for tuning in. This morning I had a supernatural event take place. I was praying in the Spirit. And I, I asked the Lord, Is the 2018 blood moon, July 2018, 2018 blood moon, is it a sign, Father? And this is what the Lord told me. This is a sign of my coming. He said, this is a sign of my coming. I received supernatural confirmation. I said, okay, Lord, if you, you told me this, Lord, please give me um, supernatural confirmation by squeezing my right hand squeezing it tight so I fill it with it so within a, a short time my right hand was being squeezed and I could feel scratchiness and I felt a tight grip and I said thank you Lord Jesus and I said Lord can I share this with your children and he says yes and I said is there a scripture I so before I put up this video, I said, is there a scripture that um, I can use, Lord? He said to go to Revelation 6. Mind you, this was for me this morning because, you know, I, I'm ready to go home with the Lord. So I'm glad that he let me share this with you guys. He said, uh, Revelation chapter 6, I went over to chapter 12, I mean verse 12, and I beheld when he had opened the sixth seal, and lo, there was a great earthquake, and the sun became black as sackcloth of hair, and the moon became as blood, and the stars of heaven fell up unto the earth, even as a fig tree casts her untimely figs. When she is shaken of a mighty wind, and the heaven departed as a scroll, when is it is rolled together, and every mountain and every island were moved out of their places. And the kings of the earth, and the great men, and the rich men, and the chief captains, and the mighty men, and every bondman, and every free man, hid themselves in the dens and in the rocks of the mountains. And said to the mountains and rocks, Fall on us, and hide us from the face of him that sitteth on the throne, and from the wrath of the Lamb. For the great day of his wrath is come, and who shall be able to stand? Amen. So what the Lord told me, go to Revelation 6. That's what I felt led to, um, to go to in Revelation 6. I thank you all for tuning in to this channel. I believe uh, the time is out. Time is out. There's no more time. Um, I don't know how, um, God's calendar is different than our calendar. I don't know how many days, weeks, or even months before the rapture of the bride. Um, no one knows, only the Father. Father God seated on the throne in the third heaven. 
Guys, um, I'm going to leave you with the midnight cry, but once again, um, I'm needing your support to, sit, to uh, do the Lord's work until the Lord comes for us. I need your support now. The link will be in the description box. And um, I love you all. If you're watching this channel for the first time, or you're watching it and you're not saved and born again, I'm going to put the salvation prayer in the description box, the comment section, and at the end of this video, in a video, come to the Lord Jesus Christ. He will deliver you. He says, come to me, believe in your heart and soul that Jesus Christ rose, um, died and rose again on the third day. And you shall be saved. I'm going to leave it down in the description box and in the comment section. Come to Jesus today. It's the best decision you could ever do. God bless you all. See you soon in the kingdom of God. Shalom. Of a mighty rushing wind Oh, and it's closer now Than it's ever been I can almost hear the Father As Gabriel sounds the call And at the midnight cry, we'll be going home. When Jesus steps out on a cloud to call his children. Children